diffusion osmosis and egg tip transport. Here's the learning points. You need to describe example for each process and compare the key points of the three process. All right. So what is diffusion? Diffusion is when particles move along a concentration gradient from high to low concentration. Here is an example like alveoli or air sacs in the lungs and the site for gas exchange. So oxygen diffuses through the thin walls into the blood to be transported around the body and carbon dioxide diffuses into the alveoli to be exhaled. What is osmosis? This is, uh, osmosis is when water moves through a partially permeable membrane from high to low concentration. Example here, red blood cells take in and lose water by osmosis. So in a concentrated solution, red blood cells shrink and lose water. In a dilute solution, red blood cells gain water, swell, or could burst. So it's very balanced. What is active transport? So active transport is when particles move against a concentration gradient from low to high concentration. So it's require energy. Here's an example like a plants take up mineral ions through root hair cells. So mineral ions are at a higher concentration in the root hair cell than the soil. So active transport is required to move the ions against the concentration gradient. Here's a quick comparison like a diffusion does not require energy, but active transport requires energy and diffusion and osmosis that is high to low concentration but active transport, that is, the, uh, that is the opposite low to high concentration. That's all guys. Thank you so much.